This is our uh, first official training call for mobile apps brought to you by Uproar.pro. Uproar.pro. You can go to Uproar.pro and see what we're all about. And you can also contact me. I'm going to give my uh, cell phone out here, uh, which is area code 805. 358 So if you're watching me on YouTube, somewhere around the country, you can contact me personally if you're interested in getting in the mobile app business. Today we're going to talk about making money in the mobile app world. We're going to be talking about custom apps and internal apps. And uh, let me give a proper introduction to the CEO of Uproar. His name is Matt McKee. He's somewhere in an undisclosed location in the United States. Matt, welcome to the call. Also on the call is our national sales manager, Howard Harris, based in Sacramento, California. And our number one salesperson in the United States, Mike Stallings, from Santa Barbara, California. So, uh, Matt, welcome. How are you, Matt? I'm good, Coach. Uh, today I'm in Washington, D.C. Washington, D.C., that's great. Uh, it's a good place to be. It is. Have a safe trip home. So today we're going to be talking about making money, selling mobile apps. We're going to be talking about custom apps and internal apps. What separates Uproar from everybody else in the country is that you, and I call you the next Steve Jobs, that's how I refer to my buddy Matt McKee. Matt and I own Uproar along with Howard Harris. Howard Harris is also a principal in uproar and Matt has developed this very unique platform and we're able to sell mobile apps at an extremely competitive price we never talk about money on the call but I will say this we can offer a mobile app at the most competitive price of anybody in the country but today's call is about custom apps and internal apps so the average app developer, as you know, Matt, probably starts an average app at around seven, eight, nine thousand dollars Custom apps can go anywhere from $10,000 to, to a half a million dollars and more. Game apps, we did a bid on a game app for $385,000 a couple weeks ago. So Matt, here's my first question to you. What determines a custom app from our everyday uh, platform app. What makes a custom app in your mind? Well, our platform app basically says that anything that a customer is doing online, we just take all of those things and put it in one place um, and say, hey, here's, here it is on a mobile platform or a mobile app. The custom app is for people who aren't doing things online and want to do phone specific ideas. For example, I want to be able to upload photos to a certain app, or I want to be able to make a game, or I want to tie into a piece of technology that isn't online, but it's basically catered to uh, a, a business itself. And a bit quite, you know, a good example of that would be Pfizer. Pfizer has a lot of different apps that they want done if they don't publish online, but they want their reps to be able to have, and they want doctors to be able to have, so that would be a custom app because none of that's public. So the Pfizer uh, apps are what? Password protected apps? They are. But not only that, uh, it's accessing just their servers, not a server that you would find online. Okay, so when I'm talking about custom apps to our clients, I always bring up the fact that we have to write some code. Can you talk about code writing, please, for just a minute? Sure. Yeah, I mean, the platform in which we built, you know, has uh, basically 20 different modules in it. Uh, you know, here's where you put your Facebook page and your Twitter page, and here's where your website goes and that kind of thing. The, um, for a custom app, we're going to look and say, um, you're asking us to do something that's not on our platform, not in one of the 20 modules, and we're going to have to write that specifically for you. And because of that, because we have to write that code, uh, we have to charge you extra. It's going to take longer, and you know, it's going to take some. Uh, well, it's just going to take some development time. The average, uh, this is uh, Coach Ron Tunick uh, on YouTube here talking about Uproar.pro, Uproar.pro. And we're talking about how to make money today selling custom apps 
and internal apps. Now it's interesting, Matt McKee, the CEO of Uproar, that when I go shopping and talking to other mobile app developers, not one, not one has even understood when I ask a question, what do you charge for an internal app? Can you take a minute uh, to our national sales force here and talk about what is an internal app? Well, internal app is uh, for the reason that a company would have, let's say they have um, you know, quite a few different reps or quite a few different uh, just individuals that they only want those individuals to be able to see information. Um, so it would be for internal purposes, let's say this private information that they may be uh, wanting to get to, or things that they want to only have in their HR department. All of those things would be why uh, we would want an internal app. Well, an internal app is also going to have just as exactly what you said, Matt. They're, they're going to have documents that they don't want the public to see. They could be HR documents. They could be training documents. They could be marketing documents. They could be marketing videos. Anything that is privy to the internal workings of a company would go on that internal app. And, of course, the question always comes up when I'm talking about internal apps you would definitely have your employees uh, sign uh, a uh, non-disclosure and of course a lot of companies in their HR documents have those protections built in place anyway so each employee would be assigned their own security code to have access to the internal app so uh, what we want to do is take this call today and the opportunity to share with you on YouTube that uh, we are an unusual company in this way that Matt McKee, our CEO, has found. Is that right, Matt? Can I use the word found? Find? You found or found? Yeah, found, right? Found the best people in the country uh, to support our, our merchants, our clients, and our reps. Talk a little bit about the unique, uniqueness, if you will, of our of our staff. Thank you very much, Matt. All right, so we're going to take a break here and uh, come back in about two seconds and get into uh, the selling of a custom app. I'm, do I'm doing the cutoff.